Hello everyone and welcome to this week's art club. Today we're going to be making paper fireworks to celebrate bonfire night. For this activity you're going to need two pieces of card in different colours, a cardboard roll, a paper straw, some glue, scissors and a pencil. Now if you don't have a paper straw at home you can use a stick or a spare pencil. First things first, take your cardboard roll and lay it against your piece of card and mark where it ends with your pencil. Then you're going to fold it in half, about where that line is, and then cut that piece of paper out. When you've cut it out nice and neatly, you're going to now roll that paper around your cardboard roll. So to do that, you're going to need some glue. So put some glue all over your piece of card. Once you've covered it in glue, lay your cardboard roll onto the paper and then gently twist it forward. You're going to roll that forward, making sure the lines all measure up, just like so. You may need to kind of pinch it a little bit to keep it glued. And then leave that one to dry and then you get your red piece of paper and start folding it in a kind of concertina shape so you can fold it over by about a centimeter if that and then you're going to cut these strips of paper out and they're going to go around your cardboard roll as well You probably only need to cut about two out. Um, but I've done a couple more just in case. You wanna get these as neat as possible. Now then you're gonna glue your red strip onto your green card. So get it all glued up and then you are gonna gently wrap it around the cardboard roll but you're going to bring it down rather than wrapping it over itself and then you'll have a little bit left over just to finish it off with so this is when you can get your second thin strip and continue that stripe all the way around And if you've got some extra, that's fine. You just snip it off at the end and tidy it up with your scissors. Now we're going to make two arrow shapes with our red piece of card to stick at the top of our cardboard roll. So fold, fold the piece of paper over um, and then you're going to draw a line to make a triangle shape in the corner just like that. So it should look like something like that and then you cut both pieces of paper out and you should be able to unfold it and it will make a bigger triangle. Now you can use your bigger triangle as a stencil for your next triangle. So you just draw around it in pencil and then cut it out.
now it's time to glue your little arrows onto your cardboard roll. So you only want to put, get the glue on the kind of the bottom half of your triangle and you want to make sure the point, one of the points of your triangle is pointing to the top and then stick it on one edge and then you're going to do the same with the other triangle but stick it directly opposite on the other side. And there we go, step one complete. Now we're going to add on our straw and some thin, wispy firework trailing. Um, so for this, you're going to have to cut out a, a few more tiny, thin strips, long, thin strips from your red card. And then grab a glue stick and glue some of the inside of your cardboard roll just like I'm doing there. And then you can stick these on the inside. And then you want to take your paper straw and just squish the top of it. Remember if you've got a stick or a pencil you might find it easier to use a bit of sellotape. Even for this you can use a bit of sellotape but I'm going to be using glue. So you want to squish down that top bit and this is going to go inside your cardboard roll. And you just glue it in. So, and you might want to put a little bit of sellotape over that just to secure it, but make sure you leave it to dry for a long time. But when you've done that, there you have it, your paper firework. Well done guys, thank you for joining us at Art Club this week. We'll see you next time.